That literally has nothing to do with this video. I, I, I'm, I, I literally only did that because it looks hella cool. But yeah, guys, welcome back to another video. Um, the beard is gone. Rest in peace, 2015 to 2015. So the subject of this video is my dog is doing things downstairs, and I don't like the noise of what she's doing. What the fuck are you doing? The subject of this video. Is the limitless pill. Well, not specifically the limitless pill itself, but creativity as a whole. So, I've just recently gone to Amsterdam. If you don't already know, if you haven't, go see my last video. Don't, I'm like, I'm, I'm saying that I'm going to put the video here and give you a link to it, but I'm way too fucking lazy for that. So just go and click my channel and go and watch that. So I've just been to Amsterdam and I did so for, you know, a little quick break. It's the Easter holiday, but... I kind of did it as like an escape, it's like, oh yeah, go on holiday, forget about other things, and then I realised, shit, you come back to them. I was like, yep, gonna go on holiday, gonna forget about all the work I've gotta do, then come home, and now I'm depressed because I've got so much fucking work to do. So if you don't already know, if you follow me on Twitter, you most definitely fucking do know, because I tweet about it every 10 seconds, I'm currently writing a screenplay for my last unit in my film course. You know what a screenplay is? Effectively, it's a step-by-step -step guide for a filmmaker to create their film. So if you've ever done acting and you have a script, it's pretty much that, but technical. So it's kind of like scenes, what the scene looks like, if there's dialogue, all that fucking stuff. Anyway, I have a very selective creative brain. By that, it's, I mean, I can be very, very extremely creative. I can think of some sort of Oscar shit, but very selective. So, my film idea is actually pretty great. Try, I'm trying to say that loosely so that I'm not like boasting and saying I'm like a fucking creative genius because I'm seriously not. This has took me a while. This has taken me months to fucking figure about this idea. I was so stressed trying to think of an idea, so don't get that impression. I had a terrible idea. Wrote it all down in my thing. And then I was like, shit, this is really bad. And then I was like, fuck, I'm gonna fail this gonna fail the course, my film's gonna be awful. When it gets shown in the cinema, everyone's gonna laugh at me. Hey, let's go to Amsterdam! So I went to Amsterdam, took my mind off it. Then I came home and I was like, shit, you're actually still gonna do that. Mm -hmm. And then suddenly, these things, right. So I needed a new pre-workout for the gym. If you don't want a pre-workout, I was drink it or you have a tablet. It gives you loads of energy and you go to the gym and you like, feel like you're on cocaine or something and you just like, do more in the gym. Anyway, these are called creatine. Creatine, basically that gives me a lot of energy. But it also, apparently, gives me a lot of selective focus because as soon as I take two of those fucking magical pills, I'm like, holy shit, gotta write an Oscar. Now I'm not gonna say, like, go and buy some tablets and they're gonna give you some super magical tablets because they're really fucking not. But I had some great creativity that came from these little two tablets. Now, I'm not gonna say that these two tablets are gonna take me into the Matrix, but it would be pretty fucking cool. This made me think. I watched Limitless the other day. Um... I watched Lucy first, then watched Limitless, and Lucy is a clear rip-off of Limitless, but we're not gonna go there. If you haven't seen Limitless, it's about a guy that finds a pill that allows him to access 100% of his brain, which makes him pretty much superhuman. But, there are side effects, which means, like, if you have the pill, you start, it starts to eat away your brain, you start dying and all that bullshit. I'll ask you guys a question. If you could take some magic pills that would give you 100% focus, 100% control of your brain, make you pretty much invincible, for say, half of your life. So say you have 80 year life expectancy, you could live until you're 40, but you have 100% use of your brain, which means you could be like billionaire, um, change the world, that jazz, you could do magical, magical fucking things. Would you do it? Now me personally, 40 years of endless happiness would definitely win 80 years of trying to find out who you are, trying to get a job, trying to get money, have kids, supply money for the kids, Retire, have money for yourself, and then start shitting yourself when you're like 80 and stuff. I would much rather have magical pills that can give me 40 years of endless happiness and full control of my brain, which makes me. Think of it this way if I have 100% control of my brain and I can start bending like fucking atoms and shit in the air, I'm gonna start being clever and think of robots and shit that I can put my brain into, which can then let me live. Past 40. Unless it's like a set, like, deal with the devil, in which case, uh, you, you definitely die at 40, then in which case you fuck. But, you could definitely make some sort of cool things in your life, like, you could, you could become a superhero. You could make suits like Iron Man, if you had 100% to control your brain. Just saying. I don't know how I've gone from writing my film to talking about 
limitless pills. And I feel like I'm promoting these pills to say, go and eat these because you're going to be fucking genius, because you're not. It just gives you loads of energy and apparently let you focus a lot. But either way, I finally did my screenplay. So I wrote it all. It's all done. I'm stress-free, friend, so yeah, I am excited. Um, the next few steps is for me to now film my film. Well, actually, I'm going to do a lot of pre-production work, such as, like, storyboards and that bullshit that I fucking hate. I have to do all that, then I'll film it, and then when the film is done, I'll upload it to YouTube and you guys can see it. I hope you like it, because this, this film idea is, like, my baby. This is my creation. This has been months of work, more, like, moulded into this one tiny little fucking device that... Basically, I'm excited to film this film now. I was really stressed because I was like, oh my god, I haven't got any ideas and it's going to go absolutely awful and everyone's going to hate me. But now I have an idea and hopefully you can actually enjoy the film. Hopefully, because if you don't, I'll probably cry. But yeah, guys, I do hope you enjoyed the video. As always, I would like to give a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Leave it a comment in the comment section telling me if you had the option to live half your life but have 100% control of your brain, would you do it? But yeah, guys, I do hope you enjoy the videos, and I shall see you in the next video. And I'm out. Deuces.